people. This is Sarah Kelly, Be Girl, Be Love. Right along with me for the second Purity Princess Warrior Bible study. Um, so, as I listen to the audio Bible in the car, as I often do, the topic came to me. Um, this is why it's important to take care of other Christians, okay? Um, feeling the call to take care of other Christians. So, um, yes. So, the scripture was, uh, actually I don't know exactly where it is. If you know this scripture, please comment. Because Jesus breaks down in like three different ways how important it is for like, and how high the reward is to like take care of other people preaching the message and preaching the gospel. So, um, I just wanted to bring this up because in my life this was really validating for me. Um, I think there's seasons where God is calling us to like street witness and that's important, okay? So I'm saying it's important. Now don't devalidate what I'm doing just because I'm not street witnessing, okay? Um, because I've had people invite me up to street witness and I have to keep saying no because God has called me on something else, okay? It's to take care of other people that are Christians. And so what was so cool is to hear the scripture is like, that's really highly prized in the kingdom of God. It's like when we look out for each other. Because you see that sometimes like Ratchet broke down like disciple teams and they're so burnt out. And it's because we're not like taking time to like ministry to each other. And I'm not just saying like, oh, you look hungry. Let me give me some food. You don't know what they need until you ask people. So like knowing other people's Christians callings. So like, and that's one thing I see in church is like, we don't really know each other's callings. Like how are we going to support each other? Now there's some people that don't know their callings yet. So like personally, I know I'm called to help other Christian female hip hop artists. And I'll tell you why in a minute, but the calling is very clear. Um, and we are clearly called to take care of other Christians. Um, if your family's already Christian, great. But if you don't have family that, like, deeply love the Lord, um, you got to find your own family, you know, and know what their calling is. So, like, part of that is, like, finding out from other Christians, like, what is their calling and who are you called to take care of and whose calling is going to take care of you. Like, so you can really stand back to back with your team, non-believers. And if you've been a Christian long enough, you know, some believers be acting ratchet. And then, like, you have the believers that are, like, really, you know, the non-believers that are, like, actually really helping you, um, helping you out. So, like, you know, besides that, besides non-believers that are really helpful, um, to find believers that are really helpful because their callings are similar to your call. Their callings complement your callings and vice versa. Um, so that's really important because like there's that deep level after Jesus changed my life and he lives in my heart. Like I can't relate to people on this like deeper level if they don't have Jesus, a love for Jesus, a protective nature for the gospel, knowing his protective nature for us. Like if people don't understand that, 